like you said, um, Harvey is still a Category 1, but uh, you expect that to change. I do expect it to uh, to, to really re-intensify as we head tonight. It's kind of paused its intensification process right now due to some, I believe, some drier air that's worked into the system. But I do expect it late, late tonight toward daybreak tomorrow to continue to, to increase its intensity. I expect it to really develop into a Category 2 by early tomorrow morning, and then most likely it will indeed be a Category 3 uh, classified as a major hurricane before uh, landfall, which is going to be around daybreak on Saturday morning. And speaking to these categories, I, I want to talk a little bit about just exactly what the different categories do to structure. So what I've laid out here is, is a structure. I have some palm trees. Of course, we're also looking at, at the beach and, and the sand and, and also the ocean. So when you think about a Category 1 hurricane, a Category 1 hurricane technically is classified. It has dangerous winds, minimal damage. Technically speaking, winds of 74 to 95 miles an hour. Now, a Category 2, things start to change with a Category 2. The winds are extreme. The damage is extensive. Winds of 96 to 110. Category 3, that begins what is technically classified as a major hurricane. A hurricane that has winds that create devastating damage. Winds of 111 to 129 miles an hour. Category 4, it just increases from there. Now, watch the structure. Watch the winds. Watch how the water continues to close in on the land, also on the home. A Category 4, winds of 130 to 156, and then a Category 5. That's the highest classification we have here with our categories. That's the Saffir Simpson scale, of course. Category 5, the last landfalling Category 5 in the United States happened on this date 25 years ago. It was Hurricane Andrew. It had winds when it made landfall of 170 miles an hour. Catastrophic damage. Looked like a bomb was dropped in Homestead, Florida. I do not expect that, fortunately for us here with Hurricane Harvey, but I do expect a strong, a major hurricane, a Category 3, when it makes landfall, and that will be around daybreak on Saturday. Let me 